hello everyone welcome back to my channel on a whole new series of microsoft excel vba programming tutorial this will be a short introduction video of microsoft excel vba i hope you will like it i'll be uploading this series as a type of course so that anyone can learn easily from this free course and it will be uploaded twice in a week on wednesday and sunday in my all videos Please check the description box there, you will find the link of downloading the data file used in that video. So without talking much, let's begin. So in this short video, we are going to know about VBA that means Visual Basic for Applications. So what is VBA? VBA which stands for Visual Basic for Applications is a programming language developed by Microsoft. Excel along with other softwares of Microsoft Office includes the VBA language with no extra charges. In a nutshell VBA is the tool that people like you and me use to develop programs that control excel imagine an intelligent robot that knows all about excel this robot can read instructions and it can also operate excel very fast and accurately when you want the robot to do something in excel you write up a set of robot instruction by using special codes then you tell the robot to follow your instructions that's kind of what bba is all about a code language for robots so what can you do with the vba you may be aware that people use excel for thousands of different tasks here you can see that we can use the vba for developing charts from data analyzing scientific data creating invoices and other forms budgeting and forecasting keeping lists and things such as customers names students grades or anything we can use it for the gift ideas and so on and on this list could go on and on but i think you will get the idea my point is simply that excel is used for a wide variety of tasks and everyone willing to learn microsoft excel vba can easily do so by watching this video of practical coding for example, you might create a VBA program to import someone's numbers, then format and print your month end sale reports. After developing and testing the program, you can execute the macro with a single command, causing Excel to automatically perform many time consuming procedures. Rather than struggling through a tedious sequence of commands, you can click a button any other task and kill some time while your macro does the works. So let's get back to the next point that is advantages of VBA. So here you can see a list of Microsoft Excel VBA advantages that is Excel performs the task much faster than you can do it manually. Excel always executes the task in exactly the same way. In most cases consistency is a good thing. If you set things up properly, someone who doesn't know anything about Excel can perform the task. If you are a good macro programmer, Excel always performs the tasks without errors. You can do things in Excel that are otherwise impossible which can make you a very popular person around the office. For long time consuming tasks, you don't have to sit in front of your computer and get bored. Excel does the work while you hang out at the water cooler, right? So the next point is the disadvantages of VBA. Sometimes things go wrong. In other words, you can't blindly assume that your VBA program will always work correctly under all circumstances. Welcome to the world of debugging and if others are using your macros like technical support. You have to know how to write programs in VBA. Fortunately, it's not as difficult as you might expect. Other people who need to use your VBA programs must have their own copies of Excel. It would be nice if you could press a button that transforms your Excel VBA application into a standalone program, but that isn't possible. 
So BBA is a moving target as you know Microsoft is continually upgrading Excel even though Microsoft puts great effort into compatibility between versions you may discover that the VBA code you have written doesn't work properly with older version or with a future version of Excel. So how you can find the Microsoft Excel VBA programming platform in your system? Simply go to your Microsoft Excel software then you can find the developer option then visual basic or you can alt f11 from your keyboard so you will find this kind of new window where you can run or code your visual basic application programming right in my next video i will cover up this whole options for you i will describe every options like this so basically this is the interface of a Microsoft Excel VBA programming. So in these options you can find there are a lot of options as I have already told you that you have a vast area where you can work with Microsoft Excel. So basically this is the thing. I will come back soon with next tutorial. Hopefully you will like this video. Keep in touch with my channel. I will be uploading more tutorials of visual basic from the beginning level share this video with your friends who wants to learn the microsoft excel bba programming from the very beginning level keep learning keep supporting this channel and stay tuned